first round game in 2A. Fifth ranked Waterloo Columbus visits Williamsburg. The Sailors playing in the postseason for the first time in nine years comes in with an 8-1 record. The only defeat coming to top ranked Wacom. Now Williamsburg despite having a 6-3 mark gets the home field advantage tonight by winning the district strict title. And Travis Breeze joins us live from Williamsburg to talk about this one. And you look like you're out front of school tonight. It looked like it was a good game for a while tonight. It really was, Rick. Like you said, Columbus comes in with just the one blemish on its resume, looking very strong. Williamsburg, though, dangerous, coming off of back-to-back 50-point -back wins, and they were thinking upset the whole time. Williamsburg seniors like Caden Wheatgen honored on a very cold and quite muddy night in Williamsburg as the Sailors cruise into town for a first-round playoff matchup. Raiders fed Wheatgen early and often. He always gets the rock for them, but their first score comes through the air. Columbus not ready at all for the pass, and Levi Weldon finds a wide-open Austin Burns. Point after was no good, but still Williamsburg goes on top 6-0. Columbus looking for something to get psyched about, and Alex Feldman delivers just that with the interception, getting the turnover and giving the Sailors another chance on offense, but they were unable to do anything with it, throwing into triple coverage on third down. Wheatgen shedding tacklers on a Williamsburg drive late in the second quarter, but a turf monster gets him, and he cannot believe it. He would get a chance to finish off the drive, punching it in from a few yards out. Williamsburg goes on top 13-0, and they keep pushing in the second half and advance to the next round. Still a great season for Waterloo Columbus, but after the game, Coach Ritchie said his team is hitting its stride at the right time. Our guys just got some experience, played hard, and you know, I think the bottom line is our, our kids and our community love to play in November, and, and this is probably the most energy we've had all year. So Columbus's season comes to an end as they fall 25-8. to eight. A heartbreak for them and the fans that traveled down for the game. Williamsburg, very impressive, though, and moving on to the second round. They have a date with Clear Lake coming up next week. Coach Ritchie said he saw a couple things that they can improve on, but he's very happy with the effort that he saw from his team tonight. Reporting live in Williamsburg, Travis Breeze, News 7, KWWL. Well, I was going to ask you a quick question, Travis. Ritchie said experience and this team at Williamsburg I mean they've been through the big games over the past few years they've been to the playoffs they've got that experience and obvious Columbus didn't have that experience they hadn't not been there in nine years so uh, and also I saw tonight a great yeah you have battle. to think that yeah, that's that, you know, that experience for sure definitely uh, came into the equation. Williamsburg, I mean, maybe not the most balanced, very run heavy with Weechin, but they were pretty much doing whatever they wanted. So looking very strong at this point. All right. Great job out there tonight, Travis.